Let's have a look at the assignment. Ali's primary research target was the Pliosaurus. Latin translation, more lizard. You'll see why. The Pliosaurus is one of the top predators of its time. We need more information about how it hunts. I strongly advise a cautious approach to avoid its powerful jaws. Teleportation nah. complete. When you're ready, focus your view on the shutter controls. Take my beef jerky and hot pockets. We're gonna make friends. Let's get started. Ali ran into trouble here. Pliosaurus thought his pod was prey. See how they patrol. You must avoid detection at all costs. Those boulders in the center seem like an ideal hiding place. Make your way there to confirm. We can continue our research without fear of attack. Tag the more aggressive one so we can get a better idea of what we're dealing with here. Hypothesis confirmed. It's definitely a Pliosaurus. Hmm, it is strange that two Pliosauruses would choose to stay in such close proximity to each other. Most apex predators are notoriously territorial. Is it possible they share a hunting ground? Tag the other and see. One of the Pliosauruses is male, and the other is female. Uh-oh. Perhaps we've found a mating pair. If so, I would expect them to be on the hunt for additional food. One theory suggests they use their eyes as their primary method of tracking prey. An eye scan would seem like a logical place to begin our investigation. Oh, that's creepy. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. No, 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 no! <laughs> This is why my mom does not let me go back in time. Alright, try the other one.
Oh yeah, you can stop time. This is so weird. Ah, the theory appears to be <laughs> well founded. The eye of the Pliosaurus is highly developed, though they would perform poorly in low light situations. Let's do our best to remain out of sight. Let's examine the anatomy of the female Pliosaurus. If Yay. they are a mating pair, I'd expect her to be carrying several eggs. I have unlocked a new <laughs> that, tool for the or... purpose. The echography scan. It will let us see a creature's internal systems in detail. Use your echography scan to gain some insight. Alright, where is the other one at? Extraordinary. The Pliosaurus is carrying a fetus, which means they give live birth. The doctor will want to see this. The pair is no doubt here hunting the smaller creatures I've detected below. Let's head down to see what creatures the Pliosauruses find so appetizing. Tag three, so that we can identify them with certainty. They seem to navigate quite easily, despite being so far down. Scan an ophthalmosaurus's eyes. Perhaps they are well adapted to see in dim light. According to my database, they have one of the largest eyes of any creature proportionally. And each eye contains a set of bones, the sclerotic ring. If we can determine how deep they can dive, it will give us a good idea of whether the bones are used to help maintain the shape of their eyes, or serve some other purpose. An echography scan of its lungs should give us a sense of how low they can go. Thank you. 
According to my calculations, they should be capable of dives of over 20 minutes at depths of 500 meters due to the pressure at those depths. Deformation of the eye would be of great concern. The sclerotic ring must guard against it. Are the Pliosauruses really hunting? The Ophthalmosauruses? They seem unwilling to descend to this depth. Tag an Ophthalmosaurus with a probe to force it to surface. Excellent. I've temporarily modified the probe to allow it to gather metabolic information from within the Pliosaurus. We are lucky. The probe was not crushed when the Pliosaurus ate the Ophthalmosaurus. We may gather valuable metabolic data from the Pliosaurus. Use an ecography scan on the Pliosaurus to locate the probe. I'll download what it recorded. tells us Pliosaurus has a high metabolism and maintains a core temperature higher than that of the surrounding water. This area is fascinating, but the data we've gathered must be uploaded and analyzed. Please scan the portal to initiate the transport sequence. God, this feels so weird. It feels like you're actually like floating. Wow. systems are now online and operational. Prepare for temporal relocation in three, two, one. There goes the shakes again. <laughs> 